Adrian! Adrian! You're not gonna believe it! Did you see a little boy back here? Yeah. What? She, she saw a little boy in the attic, so we went up there, but there was no one. So we thought, well, that he must have gone through the back. A blonde kid with shorts? You saw him? That's what I told you yesterday. I saw him yesterday and I heard him this morning. Uh, then I guess there's a kid spying on us. The countryside isn't that dull after all. That's strange, though. Didn't you say there were no neighbors? Uh, I did, but I don't know. Uh, maybe he's uh, homeless. Hmm... Or a dwarf, escape from a circus. <laughs> Sorry, a person of small size. Or maybe it's a troll. Mimi, because you Mimi, know that... stop it. <laughs> I'm just thinking. That's not normal. A small boy wandering alone when there's nobody around for miles? <sighs> well, it's not like he's dangerous or anything. So if we see him, we tell him to go home and that's it, right? What else do you want to do? Okay. Maybe he's been abandoned. He might be searching for his family. Maybe he's hungry. Maybe he's cold. I could adopt him. Yes. Mimi. Yes! I could be his mother and his father. Uh, he'd yeah, call me mother and we just go... Uh... Shut up. But tonight we make sure the doors are locked. Yeah, of course. Well, mm. I'm hungry. Let's eat something. You had a nice big breakfast this morning. Well, you had a nice big breakfast. Yeah, well, I'm single. I'm depressed. When I'm depressed, I eat. So, piss off. All right? Well, okay then. <laughs> I guess we'll prepare lunch while we wait for the others. Yeah. I really need coffee. But, but, by the way, do you know when they're coming back? Probably around 4 p.m. 4 p.m.? <laughs> I don't know. Not too late. Well, that's very funny. No, really. <laughs> that's really funny. <laughs>